Oh. Hello there. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to see any of you. Just quite yet. But these things happen. Time flies and out of nowhere you have to speed run a bunch of stuff on your days off. Isn't that just how life is sometimes? <laughs> <clears throat> anyway. Uh, sorry. You caught me at a weird moment. I was just eating candy corn. Which, uh, you know, a lot, a lot of people aren't a big fan of this stuff. But I guess... That makes me weird, right? I like it. But, I'm fine with that. Being weird is kind of what I like. Besides, being normal is so boring nowadays. But, let's not talk about me. Let's talk about what's been happening. So, as we all know, it is the horror month, or as some way say, the spooky month. And... It is that time where I would love to upload horror-themed content on this channel. However, the last few years have had minimal success, with 2020 being not too bad in terms of what I was able to do, and 2021 being the year I was really hoping for it to be big, and unfortunately, due to many, many issues and, and uh, not being able to fit with my schedule, Things unfortunately got hectic with too much work on my plate to really unfortunately make and edit videos during that time frame. However, hopefully if things can go according to plan this time around, I should be able to do such things for a few weeks. Hopefully more than once than last time. Because as we all might have, or at least some of you might have seen or known about, fortunately after those last three videos being Five Nights at Freddy's, Bending Machine and the somewhat infamous Hello Neighbor game on August 4th, 2021. Unfortunately, that is when the time skip happened until around July of this year, 2022, where I miraculously came back. So, hopefully, I shall be able to continue uploading content to a certain extent. Can't promise it'll be fast, but hopefully this month, our horror slash spooky month, as you will, will be a bit more successful this time around. Not gonna lie, many things are happening in this month and I will be very, very busy, but I'm gonna try my best, absolute best, to at least get a couple of videos out, more than three, hopefully, in this month alone. Now, the videos you are about to see, which is why I'm making this, is videos that were made last year for the intention of that spooky month event on my channel. Unfortunately, as I just said a few moments prior, things didn't work out. And unfortunately, the last few weeks caught me on caught me unexpectedly because I was so focused on many other things and many other projects and many other things uh, in general in my day-to-day -day life, as you will. But unfortunately, I didn't have enough time to record. And with this new diet and things going really wonky and just many many issues, I wasn't able to record any videos so far. However, given the time I have that it, that is my free time, I should be able to record many new videos upcoming. And you might be saying, what's this video I'm watching right now? Is this one of them? No. Because, like I said last year, was unfortunately a failure with only three videos in October. But, I was able to scrounge up some footage that I actually had lying around that I wasn't able to finish editing and upload at that time. Those are the three videos you are about to witness and watch right now. Just letting you know, they are a bit more lighthearted than the videos that will be coming up in the later months. So, if you're able to survive these three relatively with your psyche intact, then congratulations to you. But it doesn't mean you'll be able to survive the next few. So, you better prepare yourself for what's to come. But, that is enough for now. I think people should give Candy Corn another try. It's not too bad when you actually, you know, get the hang- when you actually get the taste. When you ignore certain parts of it. But, that's about it, I suppose. Don't want to keep this too long. Don't know how long these videos are going to be as it is. So, just letting you all know. Hopefully I can get this. Things have not exactly been easy, 
but I'm going to do my damn hardest to try and do what I love. Because that's what I love. I love stuff like this. But, enough drama for now. Hopefully you all enjoyed these videos, and we'll stick around for the spooky month. <laughs> Have fun. Hmm, shaped like a pumpkin. Delicious. Not too bad. Hello mods, it is Crushmaster, and welcome back to the Notes of Obsession. <laughs> which, yikes, it's uh, which honestly, now that I think about it, it's kind of ironic, because the last, ju and just like the last gameplay, which was pages, I'm collecting notes, and I was obsessed with trying to find the pages in Slenderman. Connection? Probably not, but whatever. Anyways, mods, it is. I, I like I said in the Slender Man video, if you haven't checked it out, um, it has been just under a whole year since I've played this game. And his thing, it unfortunately didn't save my progress, so I did go through the majority of what I did last time. Now, this is the second video, and I just, and I just said it was a year ago, so I'll leave a, a link in the description for any of you who want to. Um, Sorry about that. I know what's wrong with my throat. Uh, for any of you who want to see what I did, you could go in the link in the description. That will be the first video. Then come back to this video if you want, or you could just watch this video. Um, but basically, I writ I written I I was able to get three of the symbols, and unfortunately, the monster killed me. Although I did look away because I don't want to look at it too much. I don't really really see the jump scare. I caught like two glimpses of it by accident. I swear, I swear. But um, basically, there's um, we have to find all the symbols right here while this weird ghoul like monster tries to kill me um so yeah that's gonna be so fun yay <laughs> uh, so last time i was able to find five of the symbols and um uh so far i got three so and the, the thing is mods usually i would go ahead and um and there's um there's uh, Harriet, I think her her name is. Uh, where I did actually take a picture of the prologue real quick. Um, yeah, her name is Harriet, and um, he has a and sh her husband's name is Michael, and they have a son uh, as well, which honestly it's a little strange considering the fact that I have not seen her husband or her son whatsoever. Maybe this is a dream. It's a nightmare. I'm not sure. One thing as well, I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna see. Oh wait, not the, not the credits. Uh, the options. Let me see something, cause um, I tried on medium and uh, I tried on epic, all the stuff, and it was just moving a little bit too slow for my liking. So let me actually see. What about medium? Okay, medium's not that different from high, like a little bit maybe, but to me it's not that bad. So here we go, mites. After almost a whole year. Let's hopefully see if we can finish this game. Maybe. Because I know for a fact it's not that long. I know it's not that long. we got to apparently unlock this dagger with its own symbol right there. It looks like it might be... It's similar. It's this one. It's this one right here. But it's backwards. And it's, it's a sword. Hopefully we can kill this monster that's in our house. Or Harriet's house, to be more accurate. Ooh, I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. Alright, so this one near the doll, which I think I've already, um, have took. Uh, yep, I already got that one, which is right here. Ooh! Oh, God, that one, that, that's the... Ooh, where's the monster? Where's the monster? Where's the monster? Do I even want to know? Maybe I don't. Because here's the trouble, mines. I have no idea where these symbols, these last ones are. There is also one supposed to be right there in near the family portrait. Well, three of them. But uh, I already collected that one as well. So I'm um, giving you guys some advice if you're trying to get this, if you're trying to beat this game as well. Uh, let me just, let me just close that. Can I close that? Uh, let me see. Let me see. Where's the, uh, did I write down the, uh, the buttons for this? Uh, I don't know if I did. Wait, let me see. Let me see. All right. Yeah, I did. So you can't close the door, which is really stupid, because <laughs> it's supposed to be with E. 
Ah, oh, come on. I'm gonna look at every nook and cranny mods, and if I'm not able to find the symbols, I'll probably just uh, look it up, maybe if I can, or watch a video. Ooh. Wait, maybe over here? What about this? Can I. Uh, I don't think so. Uh, wait, is that one? Or is that just a light over there? Uh, nope, that's just light. That is just light. Alright. Yes! Okay, okay. This is a new one. Nice. Okay, Mike. Okay, so far, so good. We found four, and I am... Oh, I thought that was a, I thought that was a symbol last time. Is that just... Is that just, like, rain? The, the, the house does look like it's aged. It's in a bit of disrepair. Look at the ceiling. It's like water seeping everywhere. Which, to be fair, we are, I think, in Sweden. I think this game is... Or is it Russia? No, no, no. It's Russia. It's Russia. The game is Russia, and it, it does tend to uh, have some uh, weather over there. Mostly snow. I don't recall it really raining that much. But to be fair, I don't live in Russia, so I can't say much. I can't. I can't say much. Is there one near the team? Nope. 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 No. 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 Nope. 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 No. 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 Is there one near this TV? I don't think so. Do I go back in the room now? I don't think so. I don't want to. Like I said, no stone unturned. So we're gonna look everywhere I possibly can, might. Uh, oh, oh, here's one. Here's one. Right there. There's the one near the wall. Okay. Uh. There might be some upstairs. Do I even want to go upstairs? Looking anywhere possible, Mods. Anywhere possible whatsoever. Oh, I don't like that sound. There's the one over here. Monster? Okay, the monster popped up over there before. I don't think there's going to be one in like the same room. I hope not. Ah, damn. Watch out. Oh, yes, yes, yes. There's the one uh, at the end of the hallway. Uh, is that all of them? <gasps> I don't know what that was. Was it the window shut or something? I have no idea. Can I close this door? No, no, I cannot. I believe there was one over here, or maybe that was in one of the the other uh, versions I, I, I went through. Maybe I did get all the symbols. I don't think so, Might. I don't think so, though. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Let me see. How much does this TV cost? Uh, that looks like Splatoon. That literally looks like Splatoon language. Uh, okay. Uh, that is weird. Anything over here? No, I don't believe so. Oh boy. Oh boy. That's flickering. That is flickering, and I don't like the. I don't like the feel of that. Lick Lada. <laughs> the Lick Lada again. Oh boy. Anything over here? That might be. That's different. I think that's different. Fix it. Fix what? What did she do? I don't know. 
I better not be behind like one of these sticking paintings. I I see I go I think I have all of them. Maybe, maybe I might be just missing one, for all I know. Crouch, I'm gonna crouch. Can I open it? Yes I can. I'm not going to I'm not gonna attract any attention, mites. No, I'm missing one. Damn, where is it? Maybe to the kitchen. Oh, I'm so gonna regret this. Kitchen, kitchen, please, please, please. Somewhere? Somewhere, please. Oh my god, where is this damn symbol? <gasps> yes! Yes! Yes, 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 yes! <gasps> oh! I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this, right? <gasps> no, no, no. <gasps> no, no! <gasps> no. <gasps> no. Okay, this happened before I just woke up. But this is it. This is it. I got all the symbols. I'm right back here. Yes. It's time to finish this. Time to finish this. No, go around the stupid thing. It's time to do this. Yes, it's open. Well, it's after almost a year. We're finally seeing it. The end. Oh, you killed me twice, you. Technically twice. You guys didn't see the first one. There's blood on the sun's... On the sun's face. There's even a tiny, like, handprint? That looks too big to be the monsters, too. Creaky Stairs Studios. And here's the, uh, the credits as well. Oh, uh, okay. I don't... It's still going? It's still going. Uh, that was it? That's it, Mike. That looks... That's the end of the game. That's it. Okay. Um. Wow. Well, uh, let me go to the credits real quick. Here you, here they are. Creaky Stairs Studios. Uh, design, uh, sound, special thanks, uh, scenario, graphics, programming. Um, here's everybody. A uh, special thanks to Nicholas Backstrom, students of Al Kulin High School, University of Skovde, Guru Games, and everyone that helped with playtesting. Oh, I feel sorry for those people. Oh, man. But, anyways, Moids, hopefully you all enjoyed the video. Um, I know it's pretty short. Um, usually, I would, I probably would be playing something else as well, maybe to make the video a little, like, longer or something like that, but, uh, maybe to extend it. But, uh, honestly, I don't think I will. Just because I did do quite a long gameplay with Slender Man, I'm not even sure how long I'm gonna, how much I can really shorten that. I might just keep the whole video mostly together. I'm not 100% sure, but um, yeah. So here's the thing, Mars. Um, one thing before I do it in the video, Creaky Stair Studios. Actually, I was looking. I actually was interested to see what other games. What if there are any more horror games? Maybe they made I could play. So the thing is, this was actually supposedly uh, a university project or maybe a high school. I think it's a. I think it was a university project. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm still researching it. I, I don't remember too much. I just went online and looked at a few of the stuff. And apparently, it led me to a Twitter they had, which led me to a Facebook. And apparently, a group, uh, some of the people who worked on this game went and founded another sort of 
company, uh, well, not company, like a, another kind of team of developers. I don't know if I have it on me, but um, I don't know if I read if I did write the name. But apparently, um, they actually um, a group of the people who worked on this game actually have been making other games. And one game I'm actually really thinking about playing is Unforgiving a Northern Heim, uh, H Y M N. Unforgiving a Northern Heim. It looks pretty good. It's made by um, another another group of uh, the, as I said the some of the, not all the people I think some of the people because uh, in one of the Twitter posts apparently it said something around the long itself. Um, some of our friends are making games. And I'm gonna look it up right here. Unforgiving a Northern Heim. So okay, so real quick. Um, Unforgiving, a Northern Heim. It's a survival game, and they have made other ones, but this one in particular, actually, um, it's it's made by Angry Demon Studios. That's what the that's what it is, and they have made other games as well, uh, like um, Absolov End of Gods. It seems to be somewhat like like tied to Russia, or and Europe sort of mythology and like and like uh, myths and stuff like that since this one's in russia this uh this unforgiving game is a sweden survival on ends of gods which i think it's maybe supposed to be a norse mythology uh it's a swedish first person game um oh wait i think this might just be a uh, part of um part of it it's a sequel. It's a sequel to Northern High, um, to Unforgiving. So yeah, I'm I'm really really excited to see what these guys are up to and have been up to for a while because after this game, I haven't really heard anything. Because um, originally, as some of you might have heard from the, I think from my first video, I actually first got into this game and saw it from YouTuber Raspowski, um, and it was just so much fun. I think he only did one video, maybe two videos. I don't fully remember because it has been a while since I've seen it. Maybe I'll see it again after I finish recording these. But um, for the most part, I gotta say, like, I, I'm really interested because if this is just like a school project of some sort, and it, it is free to play, it's just a download um, to any of you who are interested, I gotta say that um, I, I'm really excited to see what some of the stuff that you can pay for or some of the other projects that some of these people who've made this game, because this game is really amazing. And honestly, I kind of wish it had a sequel and a little bit more to it. Maybe there is some lore or some like post, a book or, or something. As, as I said, I've only researched it a little bit. But nonetheless, I am really, really excited to see. But if any of you guys have played any of the other games or the people who some of the people who've made this game and played any of those games, leave a comment and let me know um, what kind of uh, how what you think of it. Should I play? What other horror games you, you guys are interested in? Because I'm going to be doing this for like about two to three weeks still releasing like uh, uh more horror game videos i'm even thinking about um maybe extending it a little bit to uh november i'm not 100 percent sure that's just a thought but anyways marks hopefully you all enjoyed this video please leave a like and subscribe and as i said don't forget make sure to leave a comment on any horror games um in general that you guys would like me to see and i will play it and um that's about it for now so hopefully you all enjoyed and i will see you all later let them